This is the acceleration of a brushless EV motor. Such an acceleration is possible because of precision current control. Part transform is used widely today to implement such current control. Today is the remembrance day of Dr. Robert H. Parr and as a passionate electrical engineer I would like to share how his invention is useful in EV industry. This is the age old brushed DC motor and let's assume this motor is used in your electric vehicle and you push the accelerator pedal. Now we have to increase the current to change the acceleration of your vehicle. So let me simply explain how the current control can be done. So let's assume that you are riding a bicycle and the requirement is that you have to uh, cycle at constant 20 km per hour. This is very simple that you have to pedal it at constant speed so you, you hit 20 km per hour without any trouble. Even though control is so simple, this machine is no more used in the EV industry. Because in this motor something called brush incommodator where the current is passing from stationary to rotating which is causing so much of arc and the lifetime will be a problem. To avoid this sparky stuff, we can use BLDC, brushless DC machine, in which the commutator, the sparky stuff is done through electronic switches. As the commutator was doing DC to AC, now we have to control the AC current directly. So let's assume that the same bicycle you are riding on a sine wave pattern, which has a lot of ups and downs. So now imagine how can you maintain a constant 20 km per hour because at each point the dynamics are too different and the set point values are keep on changing. This is where power transform is so useful to convert a change in alternating current into equivalent DC input for your control system. I'm not sure Dr. Park could have thought about his transform will be widely used in EV industry but today we are zipping through because of transform like Park and Clark. On this Remembrance Day, I would say thanks a lot.